Hey everybody, Real Fan Man here. Welcome back. So, uh, it's Saturday evening. Um, this is uh, a train show haul update. Um, so these are a couple of things that I picked up right here. You can see in front of you. Diesel fueling facility, uh, tunnel portal, single, single track. Um, so that's, that's pretty much the single track tunnel is for the other side of the helix. If you've seen some of my shorts, uh, my short videos, um, I have a double track tunnel portal on the other side. And um, so I just needed one for the opposite side. It's a single track. And obviously the diesel fueling facility for the diesel diesel area. We need, uh, they, need, they need to fuel up somehow. So I'm excited I finally got one of those. Paid twenty nine seventy five for that, and seven ninety five for this little guy, and then I paid ten bucks for these two, uh, these two fifty three footers, add to the collection, and uh, just real quick, I want to thank all my subscribers too, my new subscribers, uh, like my subscriptions have like blown up in the past month and I'm, I'm very grateful for that I appreciate all of you um, appreciate you checking out my channel and and uh, subscribing definitely um, very grateful so um, I don't know if anybody's seen it I am having a 500th subscriber contest and I'm looking to hold that pretty soon so um, I got a few videos to pump out I'm hoping to get these videos out within the next couple of days or so. Um, we'll see. Uh, next at least two or three days. Alright, so. But wait. As they always say, there's more. Here it comes. While I was at the train show, I uh, managed to pick up some more cars. I'm going to just use this spray can here. And uh, I picked up, uh, let's see, some, some roundhouse cars, as you can see there. A couple Burlington Northerns, uh, Kansas City, uh, KCS or whatever. They got uh, YKR. No idea who those, those are. But these box cars right here, the first, what was it, two, four, six, eight. Um, Paid like eight bucks for them, a piece roundhouse, roundhouse brand. Um, yeah, so I got the YK. Uh, I got three Southerns or Norfolk Southern box cars, all individual numbers, which is nice. I was very happy to see. There, there was so many, so many others I could have got. I'm like, no, I, I can't get too crazy, you know. Um, need to save some money for other things down the road. I uh, picked up a couple of uh, these uh, reefers, mechanical reefers, Southern Pacific Food Express. Those were, I think I paid, I think I paid eight bucks a piece for those as well. Uh, those two cars are Atherton Blue Box, um, and of course, something I've been looking for. I finally got my hands on them. Pan Am Railways or Main Central Boxcars. I got two of them. I was so psyched. Picked them up. 35 bucks a piece. I was happy with that. Those are out there and ready to roll. The CSX boxcar is an exact rail boxcar. Paid uh, 20, 20, 25 for that. Wathers LPG car, 33,000 gallon. Extra, let's see. $20 for the tank car, $12 for the extra covered hopper, and then I paid $20 for this covered this stopper right here. Because um, I want you to see the locomotive I picked up nice and slow. But um, anyways, this car right here had the horn hook coupler, so I put some um, I put some knuckle couplers on it. They're not KDs, because I still need to get some of those. Anyways, $20 came with the load. Swapped out the couplers. I was like, nice. All right, here comes my new addition. I only bought one locomotive this time. It's a B36. I okay. Uh, yeah, U36B. Sorry, U36B. It is the safety train MC MCVX safety train. 
but I definitely like the this, this style of locomotive too. I like the, the U-boats, and I think it'd be perfect for operations as it's, you know, it's only at, what, eight axle, so to be able to maneuver a little bit better. I'm still going to get some six axle locomotives down the road. I just, I think it'd be more practical for the amount of operations I'll be doing to have more four axle uh, units. It is an Atlas model. It's got the uh, ESU lock sound decoder in it. I haven't messed with any CVs right now. Um, looks, I, I think it looks pretty sharp, to be honest with you. The video doesn't do it justice. But um, I'll swing this around for you so you can get maybe a little bit of a better look. It's uh, road number 7764. Um, Hang on one second. Stand by for one second. Well, I figured I'd turn off the overhead light for a second. Swap out the... So the number boards light up. That's the front. we go over here to the back. Sorry if I'm moving you around a little bit, getting you dizzy. This is just a quick little... Okay. I need to have that on. There we go. Okay. Anyways. Really a very sharp looking locomotive, it's pretty solid. Um, like I said, I think I had mentioned this someone that you're going to see a lot more CSX, uh, CSX uh, rolling stock locomotives on my layout. As those of you that know, I've pretty much kind of picked uh, Pan Am and uh, Norfolk Southern, well, mainly Pan Am railways too. To model because I just you know I kind of grew up in Boston, Maine, and um, so on and so forth. But you know I took a lot of trips to the East Deerfield Yard, and I figured why not you know so I can model something that I know somewhat something about you know. But anyways, I'm rambling. So that is the haul. We'll give it one more run by, and uh, we will call the night. This engine sounds good. I'll shut up and there it goes. So that's at speed step four on my NCE power cab. All right, y'all. Have a good night. Stay safe. Happy modeling. Until the next video, I will have a contest update and all that stuff. I'll have a layout update coming up this week. I will have. Now, the contest update will include uh, the contests, contest rules, what to do to enter, um, so on and so forth after I post that. I'll leave that up for one week, and after the week is up, um, I'll have a set of date and time to do a live drawing. Real Lady 2020 is going to help me out. We're going to do what we did before with, uh, she used our iPad, and we did the, I think it was a the spinning the spin wheel or whatever so whatever number somebody picks it comes up boom I'll just uh, I'll have a list of names and numbers and what scale I have three scales three uh, three different scales I got N scale HO and O scale stuff so um, the O scale stuff was uh, somebody was doing a clean out and I picked picked it up they called me I didn't know what it was they didn't know what it was but I just stopped by and I was like you know what this would be perfect for a contest or when I have a contest like uh, like the 500 subscriber contest so how many times can I say contest in a single sentence right yeah. all right so train show was cool I look forward to going to the Big E train show at the end of next month um, that's gonna be some fun probably pick up a few more things there obviously some more rolling stock maybe in, maybe one more locomotive I don't know but anyways, that's it for me. Again, have a great uh, rest of your Saturday night. Take care. Be safe. And as always, happy modeling. Real Fan Man, signing out.